Yo, so this is week 6 and 7 of me documenting my journey studying machine learning. It's been quite a tough week, honestly, mentally and yeah, and on a motivation side. Here is what I did this week. So week 6 was all about linear regression from scratch. I've implemented it from scratch using only NumPy with all the inference and the quality of it stuff, both on the dummy and the real data using uh, pandas. I also made a full-on documentation with PDF and Jupyter notebook plus a .py file you can find it on the repository and um, a whole YouTube video which did quite well so yeah while studying and implementing linear regression from scratch I stumbled on gradient descent which the book I'm studying uh, an introduction to statistical learning does not cover so yeah the gradient descent is very important when it comes to uh, estimating the coefficients for the linear regression or any machine learning model uh, so first i've studied and reviewed the gradient math and the vector calculus so yeah, just a quick refresher and then i've implemented and studied the three types of the gradient descent the full batch the stochastic and the mini batch gradient descent we all implemented in numpy of course no libraries and after that, I've uh, recapped everything I've did in the generative models for classification, the LDA on the, under the quadratic discriminant analysis and the naive bias, because uh, uh, last time I didn't had a good grasp on them. So yeah, I've delved deep in the, into the st sensitivity versus specificity, the rock curve and the discriminant functions. Just later on to discover that the most most of the generative models like the LDA and naive bias aren't that useful nowadays and uh, they're kinda useless so yeah that was uh, kinda demotivating for me which lead me to talking about me struggling with motivation and time management I've spent around five days doing literally nothing and all the m social media distractions talking about AI and you know all the talk they do yeah, it really got to me but yeah later on I realized that it's part of the journey and pushing through this is what's gonna be it's gonna be worth it and it's gonna be the, the difference maker between just being a, a hobbyist or uh, an engineer so yeah after that after the five week uh, five days we uh, rest oh my god i can't talk i started the resampling methods which is chapter four of the book i'm reading right now which is an introduction to statistical learning i've made an overview on the cross validation and the bootstrap and i've studied quite a bit to leave one out and the k-fold cross validation i've read about the bias variance trade-off which which is quite interesting you know it plays a big role on the model selection and currently implementing uh, the cross validation from scratch using a real data set here is a rough plan on what i'm gonna do next week i'm gonna be the, or the next two weeks i'm gonna finish chapter 4 resampling which is quite short so yeah i will also make a video about the logistic regression a man in video probably you know which because uh, the logistic regression is one of the most important concepts if not after the linear regression in uh, machine learning I will finish the exercises for the classification chapter and uh, push push them to github I will implement logistic regression from scratch this is probably for uh, the week after and reorganize the repository for more detailed notes and the clear clear structure because a lot of people find it useful so yeah it's quite nice and uh, yeah, if you want my derivations, everything that is with machine learning, I've studied so far, and linear regression implemented from scratch, uh, there is the link below for my GitHub. Start it and uh, follow me. So yeah, thank you for watching. See you next week.